because I was, and this probably explains why my wife didn't like me in high school, I was not a nice, I was not nice. Like I thought I was really cool. And you know, I was, you know, baseball player, football player, you know, the smart jock, but I was actually quite mean to people and a little bit of a bully, not like terribly, but a bit looking back. What age are you? Uh, 17 to even the first couple years of college. And it definitely coincides with my mom being sick and stuff. I think it unleashed some anger in me, but I was so consumed with what people thought. And actually, I think I know that they thought I was an asshole, but I thought they maybe thought I was the coolest guy ever. I would go back and tell that kid to be yourself because I think I was a late, very late bloomer. Um, I think Steph taking a chance on me, even when I was like 21 and turning the corner a bit, I was still, that happened right after my family gave me literally like a sit down of you can't drink like this. You can't, you know, you can't get in fights. You're, you know, you're an adult now. Um, literally like an intervention. At my, say, who was it? Who, who was doing this? My three brothers, including the really bad one, <laughs> and my dad. And without, stat, like, I'll tell you, I can't give you any things that were, that I would change from the point I met Stephanie. This sounds really corny, I know, but she changed my life in a, in a great way. And I would, I would, I feel like there's four or five years there where I wasn't the person that I should, that I am. I, I'm not that person, but I was probably unilaterally awful. Luckily, I have the same best friends, and they kind of were able to live through it. Um, so I would go back and tell that guy, just be yourself, be a nice human being. And uh, I, I, I hope so. It's kind of funny. I have, there's a girl who I was not nice to, like not in a, just like, she wasn't very attractive, and I was really mean to her. And I found her on Facebook and really, I think, gave her a very heartfelt apology. And I think I, that... Oh, it made a huge difference for me, and I hope that it made a difference for her.